Howdy folks, my name is Nick Saylor. I've been working here at Benke Mountaineering for the past five years as our events coordinator and our hard goods buyer. Uh, I've also been playing in the back of Colorado since 2002. In this video we're going to be talking about the BCA float series of Audi airbag packs. BCA is known for helping to revolutionize the avalanche beacon market by releasing the first digital transceiver known as the DTS. Uh, they're also credited for helping bring airbag technology to North America. Using proven components and a 100% mechanical deployment system, BCA has continually showed that they know snow safety. Let's get to it. In front of me is the BCA Float 27 Tech, a new pack for the 2014-2015 season, which really shows BCA's continual commitment to improving their overall float systems. Now, at the heart of these systems is a canister of compressed air and a mechanism called a Venturi valve. Now, as I mentioned before, all BCA float systems are 100% mechanically driven. There's no batteries, there's no explosive, there's nothing to replace after the deployment but the air in the canister. Let's go ahead and take a moment to look at the deployment system that's going to reside in all of the float packs. Starting here is the deployment handle. Now, when pulled, it triggers a cable that runs all the way to the interior of the pack to the top of the canister. Now, when the canister is triggered, it releases the air which flows into the Venturi valve. Now, the revolutionary concept with that Venturi valve is that it actually then pulls air from outside of the canister to help fill the airbag. Now, what was so special about that is it allowed manufacturers and designers to start using a smaller canister and one filled to a lower pressure to fill the whole 150 liter bag in still under three seconds. Moving on to the packs themselves, BCA has a very, very well thought out lineup of packs this year. From the Float 22, which would be a perfect side country or short tour day pack, uh, all the way up to the Float 42 Tech, a uh, big pack for long trips, uh, guys, or even overnight trips to huts. Um, BCA has spent a lot of time making sure that they don't just have a good system, but they have good packs that they can build around it. Now let's go into the actual Float 27 Tech and show you some of the more specific features that this guy has. All right, let's go ahead and open up the pack so we can take a look at not only the float system itself, but some of the features of this backpack. Starting up at the top, this is where the airbag itself is stored. It deploys up through the top into a pillow shape. Uh, on the inside, the airbag system is really well organized and protected. We have a sleeve for your canister to rest in. We also have a, a flap here that helps protect the hose that runs from the canister to the Venturi valve, as well as this hose that protects the wire that runs the deployment handle into the canister which releases the air. A uh, small organization pocket right here, it's good to point out it is a true 27 liter capacity. Uh, unlike previous uh, float packs in the past, this really does give you a lot of space and the airbag has been redesigned to take up a minimal amount of that uh, overall volume. Looking at the outside of the backpack, I'll start off and kind of point out a very important feature. That top zipper gains access to your avalanche safety equipment pocket. Also on the front of the backpack, you have a small pocket which stores your helmet carrier. This comes out, attaches to the front there. It's good to also know, they, they call this the Float 27 Tech for a reason. Uh, fully sleeved uh, ice tool or a mountaineering axe attachment points. You have your diagonal ski carry system set up right here. Small accessory pocket up at the top for sunglasses or goggles. To flip it around, I'll definitely spend a moment talking about one of the coolest features of this pack that not too many other companies offer. As you can see, there's a zipper down either side. And what it allows you to do is to move the deployment handle to your left or right side. Uh, whether you know, you're left-handed or if you're a snowmobiler and need to keep your hand on the throttle, it allows you to have that deployment handle easily within reach. Two other small accessory pockets uh, on the hip belt and a really well-designed little sleeve to store your tension strap, which runs through your legs, keeping the backpack uh, locked to your body if you were uh, caught in avalanche. <laughs> Alright, now for the fun part. We're actually going to be able to deploy one of these float packs so you get an idea of exactly what it's like to pull one at home. To start, go ahead and take the backpack, throw it on like any other, cinch down the shoulder straps. The next step is definitely of vital importance. This is your retention strap. Pass it between your legs, loop it through one side of your waist arms, 
one metal buckle through the other, cinch it down, and now you're good to go. Expose the handle, and when you're ready, give it a sharp pull. Now, compressed air canisters like in the BCA flow are good systems, but they do have a few issues. To begin, it can be challenging to fly with a flow system or any compressed air system for that matter. When you go to the airport to travel with one of these bags, you need to empty the canister as well as remove the entire top of the cylinder before flying with it. Now, it's not the end of the world, but it does mean that at your destination, you don't just have to get it refilled, you have to find somebody with a torque wrench to reattach the top of the canister for you. Now, on the topic of refills, BCA over the last couple of years has worked hard to build a wide-reaching refill network across the country. That combined with the fact that you can have them refilled at paintball stores, scooter shops, and even some firehouses gives you a pack that will give you confidence that you can use it for a long time, nothing will ever become obsolete. Uh, it's always possible to go out and find more compressed air. Alright guys, thanks for watching our video today on the BCA float series of Abbey Airbag Packs. Go ahead and visit bentgate.com for more information about the different airbag systems out there on the market. If you happen to have any more questions, shoot us an email, give us a call, and once again, thanks for watching our videos.